Happy New Year, guys. Here's to an amazing 2018. Let's kick off with MTV News. New Year, new you. Sophie Kasai is glowed up and celebrating the brand new MTV Fit with a hilarious video about gym expectation versus reality. Hi guys, I'm Sophie Kasai and this is expectations at the gym versus reality at the gym. So basically you go to the gym, you want to let everyone know that you're there. So you're going to be there for hours, but are you going to go on the treadmill for hours? No. Are you going to be taking selfies for hours? Of course, because you want to let your crush know that you're working working out and getting fit for him. So you're ready to get back into the gym and you've went out and you've bought the most amazing sportswear and obviously it's grey because every girl's bum looks good and grey but there's a problem. You've just sweated your face off for an hour on that treadmill. Now you are left with a sweat patch that everyone can see. Not only does it look like sweat but it looks like you've weighed yourself next time. Bye black. So you're at the gym and you're looking around and you can see everyone using these amazing machines and you're thinking, you know what? I'm gonna give that a whirl. You go and give it a whirl and before you know it, you've done it wrong, you mm. broke a limb, you broke your arm, you're in hospital, now you're off the gym for six weeks and you've ended up eating your body weight in food. So guys, play it safe. Stay with the freeway. Us girls know that when you go to the gym at a certain time, it's called ting time. There's gonna be a lot of fit lads there. And when you're there, you can see a boy looking at you and you're like, yeah, I'll give it a couple of squats. Hopefully he's looking at me bum. He's looking, he's looking at me bum. He's looking, he's looking. Oh wait, he's just looking at yourself. You wanna get a gym membership and of course you wanna pick the best gym. So you go online, the brochure pictures are absolutely fantastic. But then you get to the gym, realise it's been run down for about 40 years. Your dad wouldn't even go there and everything is covered in sweat. No thanks, take me membership elsewhere. So you've got yourself prepped to go to the gym. You've got your gym gear on, you've got your bottle of water, you've got your protein shake, you've had your pre-workout and you were ready to go. You get to the gym and realise, this. I'm going back home to watch EastEnders. Logan Pauls apologised for posting that Suicide Forest video after being slammed for uploading it in the first place. The clip, which garnered millions of views before it was removed, showed the vlogger and his mates finding a dead body in Japan's notorious Suicide Forest, located at the base of Mount Fuji. The guys approached the body, zoomed in, and were even seen smiling and joking about what they saw. And now, after backlash from both fans and celebrities, Pauls issued an apology on Twitter, saying he was misguided by shock and awe. I didn't do it for views, I get views. I did it because I could make a positive ripple on the internet, not cause a monsoon of negativity. I intended to raise awareness of suicide and suicide prevention. But celebs have been having their say, with Game of Thrones star Sophie Turner tweeting, you're an idiot, you're not raising awareness, you're mocking. I can't believe how self-praising your apology is. While breaking bads, Aaron Paul hit back with, you are pure trash, plain and simple, suicide is not a joke. If you or someone you know is having suicidal thoughts, call the Samaritans on 116 123. People on Twitter are pitching their own Black Mirror episode ideas and we are so here for them. The Netflix show saved our New Year's hangover when it dropped and fans of the show have been coming up with amazing new episode ideas that we think just have to happen. For example, the future of Tinder. You give the app your DNA, then rather than seeing pics of your date, you swipe left or right based on photos of the kids you'd make together. Or an episode where all of your selfies and nudes and that picture you took of your down below when you had that spot once are played on your deathbed. Here's another, where everyone you meet becomes an app in your phone and if you delete the app, they die in real life. Sorry, Mark. I needed the storage. And finally from Eve, and this would be so real, an episode where you open your phone on front facing camera with a hangover. Let us know your Black Mirror pitch in the comments below. I can't wait to read them. Thanks for watching MTV News today, guys. I'm James Barr and MTV Fit is my inspo right now. So I'm off to hit the gym. See you soon. I'm not really, I'm gonna go and eat pizza.